Hi, Starcy from DarcyandBrian.com, and today I thought I'd talk a little bit about pros and cons of taking your baby along to a blogging conference. <laughs> um, I have gone to a conference with my four-month-old. Um, I just took him to Blistom. I've been to a conference while very pregnant. I have been to a conference with my husband and my toddler along. Um... Unfortunately, I really haven't been to one by myself. The only time I was by myself, I was very, very pregnant. So, <laughs> I'm always carrying somebody. With my son being four months old, the pros outweighed the cons. So, I felt that the newborn days were actually a very good time to take take a baby to a conference. Um, it was actually a very good time to take him to a conference because he slept most of the time or was content just to like look at people and smile and babble a little bit. Some of the pros to taking a baby to a conference is it's a great icebreaker. Sometimes I'm a little shy in a big setting like a conference with a lot of people around that I don't know. So having my son with was a great icebreaker because there were people that would come up to look at him, you know, to ooh and ah or whatever, and that would help us strike up a conversation. Great. He helped me feel more comfortable because <laughs> he helped me feel more comfortable because I'm at home with both my kids. So when I have a chance to be without them, as much as it feels great, it doesn't take very long before I feel weird. Like I feel like something is missing. There's supposed to be a child at my lap. There's supposed to be someone tugging on me. There's supposed to be someone crying for me. Uh, so it helped, you know, keep me feel a feeling more comfortable because he was with me. Um, if you, if you breastfeed like I do, bringing him with means you don't have to worry about pumping. That was great for me. Otherwise, I would have had to pump ahead of time to make sure there was enough of a supply for my husband to feed him. And then I would have had to keep pumping while I was at the conference to keep my supply up. And this way, I just had to nurse him. I just had to feed him. I didn't have to worry about lugging my pump. Another pro is that... He's a good excuse for having to go back to my room and relax. Um, I mean, we all need to be aware of time, you know, we all need to be aware of, we all need to be aware of when we need a time to be alone, to regroup and decompress, but he actually made that easier for me because it, I can get talking with someone or hanging out or whatever and just get too wrapped up in what's going on and lose track of time, and with him... I didn't have to worry about being up too late, though I one night I stayed up a little too late in my room working on my computer, but, you know, he helped make sure that I took some time to just relax and, you know, it, and regroup, recharge my batteries throughout the entire time, so that was great, um, but honestly, the biggest pro is that he was a good icebreaker, he really was. Um, some of the cons, you have to bring baby gear. You know, you have to have a stroller and all that stuff. That can be a lot when you're traveling, and it can be a lot when you're maneuvering around in a conference, too. Sometimes, I, there, you know, there were things that I don't experience because I've got to figure out, can I get the stroller in through all these people? I don't want to be rude. I don't want to be shoving into people. Um, I worried about him disrupting sessions. That really didn't happen, but <laughs> you can hear him right now. I mean, your baby along, you pretty much miss out on the after hours partying and stuff. For me, that's not a huge thing. For me, that's not a huge thing because I'm not a, a really a drinker anymore and not really a partier. But, you know, sometimes it's sort of like, oh, I wish I could kind of go with everybody. But uh, if there's other if you know that there's other moms there with their babies, if you know there's other women there with their babies, hook up with them for a play date. You still have fun. <laughs> you know, I know sometimes moms are concerned about whether or not they should leave their babies behind so they can go to a conference or think that they can't go to one because they can't leave their babies. But if you check in with the conference to make sure that they're baby friendly, because some conferences don't want babies around and just dis disrupting things but other conferences especially ones that you know are filled with a lot of attend of mom attendees 
you know, they understand that we can't always make arrangements to go without our baby. 